What's up, Tubes? Just chilling out in the back, looking at the pool. Getting close. It actually might be time to take a little dive. Still a little bit dirty in there. Um, after we had the big freeze here in Texas, all my pool stuff busted, you know, the pumps and whatnot. I still haven't been able to get some parts. I've got the main pump running, but the, the uh, little cleaner guy that cleans the bottom, it's his pump doesn't work, so still waiting to find parts for that. Anyways, um, we've got a new package today. This is a BMS. This is going to be kind of interesting because I think this is basically a Dali BMS clone. It looks exactly, I don't know if you guys have seen these. Let me see. Let's go. Let's get it opened up. There you go. Look at this. I mean, it really has, <laughs> it has this, it looks exactly like a dolly. The same case, same design, but why, okay, why do you have to come up with a name like this? V-N-S-Z-N-R. Could you not have come up with a better name? <laughs> V-N-S-Z-N-R. You know, you got to get that V-N-S-Z-N-R. <laughs> V Visner, you do Visner. Anyways, they they have um, a lot of different ones. This company, and they all look exactly like the Dallies. You know, like one for one. There's you know, the non-smart. This is a smart, and I guess we're gonna see if it you know if it works with the Dally BMS um, app. <laughs> but they've got you know. 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, you know, 100 amp, you know, from 4S to 20 or, you know, like, just like the dollies. So, we're going to build a pack. This is a 4S, 60 amp, okay? We're going to build up a pack and strap this guy on it and see how it performs. Alrighty guys. So I've got the VNS ZNR uh, BMS hooked up to a little battery pack, just temporary, so we can play with it, you know, test it out. Um, yeah, again, the, the Dali, you know, clone, I guess. Um, <clears throat> so, I downloaded the Dali Smart BMS app from the uh, Google Play Store on this, and uh, I guess let's see if it'll connect. <laughs> well, look at that. It does indeed um, work, apparently. Uh, 3.1, 3.1, 3.1, 3.059. Nice. So, the uh, actual Dali Smart BMS application works with the um, uh, clone Dali. Let's run a charge into it and see. Here we go. Yeah, yeah, it shows five amps going in. 5.1 amps. Right here. Can you see it? Yeah, I hope you can see that. It's saying 26 uh, degrees Celsius. So, I guess what we want to do too is see if. Yeah, the temperature is going up uh, now that I'm holding the temperature probe. So, see if it stops. Let's see if the low temperature disconnect functions, right? Because that's what we got to do, right? Whoa! So, the, the, 
the low temp protection. Uh, can you see it? The low temp protection is negative 40 <laughs> for discharge and negative 40 for charge by default. Okay, let's fix that. Let's do negative. Let's just let's just do zero. Oh, I gotta have a password. One, two, three, four, five, six. It came with instructions. Okay, set. There we go. Uh, I think it can discharge uh, and not damage it, but whatever. We'll just do zero two. Yeah. So there's there's the if you can see the whole thing. You know, there's the Dali. Uh, smart app so okay let's uh and let's try to freeze up this probe ah stay in there is that three degrees one come on It's at 1C. Come on. Get cold. I usually use the canned air to do this. It works so much better, but I don't have any. So, <laughs> I'm not sure. Oh, there we go. There we go. We went to negative one. Bam. It disconnects. Okay, so that works. All right, guys. So, the <laughs> clone... Dali BMS works with the Dali BMS smart app. You can set all the settings. You can see all the parameters. This is really cool. I really like this app. Um, let's see. I'm sorry, you can't, can't really see it. Everywhere. I need some filters for this camera. But you can set all the parameters. It seems to work really good. Like... I really like JBD uh, or JDB BMSs, uh, but I don't know. I might end up liking these better. So, anyways, this is a uh, a 60 amp 4S. Um, I think it was like 60 something dollars on Amazon. Like, and uh, the nice thing is about about this knockoff VS VNS ZNR brand. <laughs> which I'm pretty sure it's exactly a, a Dali BMS. I got it like next day or something. So like if, you, if you're buying Dali BMSs, it's, it's sometimes hard to get them or hard to get them in a, um, you know, in a, in a reasonable amount of time. So uh, it's what I would definitely call inexpensive. It has Bluetooth. They had the other ones with no Bluetooth if you want that. And that are, it's like a little bit cheaper, maybe ten dollars cheaper. The Bluetooth, the smart BMS thing, is just so worth it in my opinion. I, I wouldn't even, I don't at this point I don't think I've even consider getting a you know a non-smart BMS because it has all the stuff in it that you want. You know, it has the basically a shunt. It it, it can tell you how much power you've taken out, how much you've putting it putting in. I mean, just being able to monitor all that, it's so so good. Uh, but yeah, I mean, you can get these. You can buy them right off Amazon and get them like next day or day or two or something like that. And super inexpensive. Um, I'm probably going to end up, you know, building a real pack with this at some point. But I just wanted to test it. And yeah, it absolutely works as expect expected. So there you go. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe. Leave me some comments. Uh, let's discuss this stuff. Don't uh, don't be afraid to to discuss uh, all this stuff in the comments. Uh, it, it really helps me out, actually, if you do. Anyways, um, I'll catch you on the next video.